Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Why are politicians spreading baseless claims about immigrants eating pets? The recent spread of baseless claims about Haitian immigrants eating pets in Springfield, Ohio, is rooted in a series of events and social media posts that have been amplified by politicians. Origin of the claim. The claim started with a post in a local Facebook group in Springfield, Ohio. A woman named Erica Lee shared a story she heard from a neighbor, who heard it from a friend, who heard it from their daughter. The story alleged that a cat was found hanging from a tree near a house occupied by Haitian immigrants ready to be skinned and eaten. This post was later shared on X, formerly Twitter, and went viral. Political Amplification Ohio Senator J.D. Vance picked up the story and used it to attack Vice President Kamala Harris and the Biden administration's border policy. Vance stated on X that people had reported their pets being abducted and eaten by individuals who shouldn't be in the country. Lack of evidence Local authorities, including the Springfield police and city officials, have repeatedly stated that there are no credible reports or specific claims of pets being harmed, injured, or abused by the immigrant community. Despite this, the claim has been repeated by various politicians and social media figures. Wider impact. The claim has been shared widely on social media platforms, garnering millions of views. Other figures such as Texas Senator Ted Cruz and even Elon Musk have shared memes and posts related to this unfounded claim. Trump himself repeated the claim during a presidential debate and at a rally, despite the lack of evidence. Official responses. The city of Springfield and local law enforcement have issued statements refuting the claims. Springfield city manager Brian Heck's office clarified that there have been no credible reports of pets being harmed by the immigrant population. Nature of the claims. These claims are part of a broader narrative of anti-immigrant rhetoric, which has been a consistent theme in Trump's campaign. The allegations are not supported by any credible evidence and have been labeled as dangerous and rooted in racism. County Office. Countyoffice.org slash. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.